Good evening, and welcome to the 2020 Virtual Phi Theta Kappa Induction Ceremony. My name is Deborah Anderson, and I'm a professor of English and the coordinator for our Phi Theta Kappa chapter called Beta Eta Phi. I'd like to begin by congratulating the inductees on all of their accomplishments. This is a special ceremony to honor you for your outstanding academic achievement. We're lucky to have you as part of our community college. At this time, I'd like to introduce the president of Bristol Community College, Dr. Laura Douglas. President Douglas will welcome our Phi Theta Kappa inductees and invited guests. Hello, Phi Theta Kappa inductees and honored guests. Congratulations on being inducted into the prestigious Phi Theta Kappa Society and into Bristol's chapter, Beta Eta Phi. While this year has been challenging, you rose to the occasion by adapting to unprecedented changes at home, school, and work, and maintained high academic standards in the face of it all. We're so proud of what you've accomplished both in class and through the service and awareness activities you participated in this year. Some of you will continue to develop yourselves as scholars at Bristol, and others will be moving on to careers and other academic opportunities. Wherever you're headed, we are proud to say that you are members of our Beta Eta Phi chapter. You have made important contributions to the reputation and character of our college. And on behalf of the faculty and staff of Bristol Community College, I thank you and congratulate you on this significant achievement. Thank you, President Douglas, for being a part of this ceremony and for all of the support you've provided to our students this year. This has been an exciting year for our Phi Theta Kappa chapter. This year, students from our chapter partnered with the Multicultural Student Center as volunteers at the Martin Luther King Breakfast and at community workshops that Bristol offered that day. PTK students also volunteered at Bristol's mobile market this spring. Additionally, we established an executive board of PTK student officers who collaborated to create the club constitution, apply for student club status, and propose a bylaw change that allows students to be inducted sooner in their academic journey at Bristol. They did this to enhance engagement in our chapter and provide students with more leadership and scholarship opportunities while they're at Bristol. These officers held a number of table events on the Fall River and New Bedford campuses and are maintaining a social media presence for our chapter to increase PTK engagement at our college. I'd like to thank the Bristol Community College Foundation for its generous contribution to our chapter this year. The funds raised on our chapter's behalf were used to reduce the one-time fee that students pay to the international and regional Phi Theta Kappa organization when they join. The generosity of the foundation made it possible for students to join this year at a reduced rate, and we plan to offer the same opportunities to students during the 2021 academic year. At this time, I'd like to present the following candidates for induction beginning with the officers of our Beta Eta Phi chapter. They are Michael Sivianakis, President, Majulette Hudson, Vice President, Paul Ruta, Treasurer, and Casey Macomber, Recording Officer. Other PTK inductees include Lisa Abadamarco, Ryan Adams, Tyler Allard, Raquel Almeida Vieira, Claire Ann Andrade, Anishali Aquino, Eric Archambo, Amanda Aruda, Madison Aruda, Samantha Aguelo, Sarah Ayala, Christian Azevedo, Bailey Bayarjan, Andrea Ballard, Melissa Belfoy, Jacob Burt, Nina Bimicham Abunwe, Lydia Bolger, Aubrey Bonia, Melinda Borges, Benjamin Bowman, Anya Boyd, Allison Brum, Lisa Burgess, Michelle Cabral, Kennedy Callahan, Kaylee Kaluro, Katerina Camara, Mark Camara, Sarah Candido Velasquez, Anna Cespedes Dowling, Megan Chapman, 
Michelle Chen, Giali Cheng, Caitlin Cody, Margaret Kaur, Taylor Coelho, Brendan Cooney, Morgan Cordero, Angela Correa, Covadis Costa, Rachel Costa, Lucia Creador, Penny Cruz, Kevin Curley, Clarissa De Silva, Hannah DeVignan, Alexis DePina, Anita DeBrito, Michelle Delgado, Tate DeTerra, Ashley Diaz, Lindsay Diaz, Dwayne Dion, Elidia Dos Santos, Kayla Duart, Paula Duart, Cameron DuPont. Next, Casey Macomber will explain the significance of the PTK emblem. Hi, I'm Casey Macomber, Beta Eta Phi Recording Officer. This is the emblem of Phi Theta Kappa. The gold field refers to the golden opportunities available to us all. Since gold is the most noble of metals, it has further significance to our society, for it represents the nobility attained by those who achieve intellectual leadership. Across the gold fields is a black band. It represents the three ideals which band us together. Shining through the black enamel background are the three Greek letters, which are the initials of three Greek words, meaning wisdom, aspiration, and purity. Behind the band is a wreath, on the one side composed of oak leaves and on the other, laurel. The oak leaves stand for stability and strength of character. The graceful curling leaves of the laurel signify achievement and success, all attributes for membership in our society. Above the band is the representation of the head of Athena, the goddess of learning. In the base appear the Greek letters meaning light, the light of knowledge and learning, the common ideal for members of Phi Theta Kappa. The badge stands as a symbol of the high idealism of our organization and membership in our select group. I am pleased to present the following candidates for membership in our society. Madison Edwards, Augusta Egby, Cristobal Escobar, Tammy Esposito, Courtney Farris, Ashley Felacio, Alyssa Fernandes, Sarah Ferraz, Carmelia Ferreira, Susanna Figueredo, Emily Flanagan, Haley Flanagan, Farron Fleming, Kerry Fraid, Mafalda Franco, Linda Fryer, Jeremy Fry, Jeremy Gable, Chancy Gadboys, Riley Gant, Tanya Garcia, Marisol Garcia Sanchez, Teresa Gomes, James Gonville, Christine Haston, Romani Helcani, Willow Hoagland, Ashley Holbrook, David Holtz, Marvansky Honor, Narla Honor, Kelsey Houlihan, Alexis Howell, Nadia Amoro, Alina Inchostagai, Alferi Isles, Carissa Janvren, Kyle Johnson, Maya Johnson, Edwins Joseph, Zed Karabai, Nina Kruger, Alan Lambacker Jr., Allison Lemos, Corinne LePage, Tommy Lipset, Tyler Litchfield, Nati Hanath Long, Bashang Long. Now I'd like to introduce Maggie Hudson to explain the purpose of Phi Theta Kappa and present more candidates for induction. I'm Maggie Hudson, Chapter Vice President. The purpose of Phi Theta Kappa is to foster among its members a spirit of devotion to the hallmarks of Phi Theta Kappa, leadership, service, and fellowship, and to create a welcoming intellectual climate for the interchange of ideas and ideals. Among us, membership is a privilege earned by academic merit, honor, and service. In the conduct of our activities, truth should be our quest, diligence our staff, an achievement of excellence, our purpose. Before reading the next set of inductee names, I would like to take a moment to thank the faculty, staff, and administrators 
of Bristol who have supported us through our time at the college. On behalf of Phi Theta Kappa chapter, I would like to thank you for your flexibility and patience during this unusual year. We would also like to thank Lindsay Alza for stepping us as our first chapter president. Finally, and most importantly, we would like to thank our family and friends who boosted our confidence with a kind word or took on some responsibility in our busy lives so that we can focus on our studies. We can't thank you all enough. Now I am pleased to announce the following candidates for membership in our society. Andrea Madeira, Jennifer Mahoney, Ross Marston, Shana Marsakowski Krowitz, Renee Martin, Julie Martins, Caitlin Mason, Gorette Matos, Tracy Ann Mazzola, Edwin McAuliffe, Jessica McKee, Hannah McMorrow, Christina Medeiros, Mark Medeiros, Zachary Mello, Haley Manier, Madeline McCall, Brittany Miller, Shelley Milligan, Brendan Monohan, Sephra Moniz, Adi Morales Rivas, Jonathan Morrison, Ethan Mort, Lindsay Mata, Alicia Moyer, Alexandra Murphy, Robert Murray, Amanda Moskett, Michael Nadu, Christine Nagoyan, Esther Nitin, Melissa Oliveira, Kenya Ortez Moreno, Lindsay Asa, Alexander Owens, Paige Pacheco, Sasha Pacheco, Jean Pacito, Alicia Pava, Het Patel, Emily Pelletier, Julianne Pereira, Anna Perry, Darlene Pina, Michaela Pinkston, Asma Reyna, Philippa Raposo, Ryan Raposo, Shomia Reddy, Bailey Redman, Amber Reese, Brandon Reese, Michelle Reese, Ruthin Reynolds, Jonathan Rishi, Carrie Riox. Michael Sivanakis will present the final candidates for induction and read the Phi Theta Kappa Pledge. Hi, I'm Michael Sivanakis, your chapter president. It is my honor to present the following candidates for the Phi Theta Kappa induction. Natalie Rivas, Aaron Rockliffe, Nitzia Rodriguez, Jennifer Ronca, Cameron Rose, Natalie Rose, Rachel Rose, Jose Andre Evriard, Jared Roy, Maureen St. Fard, Ashley Santos, Kylie Serpa, Abigail Sherwin, Leanna Silva, Sandy Silva, Tess Silva, Alyssa Silvera, Brianna Smith, Julia Smith, Rebecca Smith, Madison Soares, Sheridan Solomon, Ashley Soto, Maria Spencer, Scott Standring, Jacqueline Sullivan, Katie Sullivan, Michael Sylvester, Brett Talbot, Abigail Tavares, Margaret Thomason, Danielle Tibbetts, Ashley Tupin, Justin Tracy, Allison Tripp, Katrina Tripp, Michelle Ubinas, Christopher Vasconcelos, Jessica Ventura, Clay Ann Vieira, Maya Walker, Matthew War, Cassandra Wenner, Charlotte White, Lauren White, Michael Whitney, Kelly Williams, Robert Wing, and Kevin Zalea. Now that the standards and ideals of this organization have been revealed to you, we ask that you recite the pledge which admits you into complete fellowship. Please insert your name when I say mine. I, Michael Sivinakis, do solemnly promise to uphold the standards of Phi Theta Kappa and to keep this object and aim in mind. And I do solemnly pledge allegiance to my fellow members and promise to aid them in all worthy endeavors. Congratulations, everyone.
It's my pleasure to welcome you into the Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society and the lively fellowship of scholars it affords. You fulfilled all requirements for membership. Congratulations on your accomplishment. I charge you to always seek the truth and to dedicate yourself to the cultivation of the well-reasoned life, a prelude to service and honor. Thank you for being a part of our chapter and participating in this ceremony. Thank you.